Okay everyone, today I'm going to show you all how to use Advanced Map. If you don't have it, you can download it from my new site. There's a link in the description. Now, open up Advanced Map and you'll find a few buttons on the top left. Create New Map, Insert Map, Open Previous Map, Show Sprites, Save, and Open ROM. Click on Open ROM and then find your ROM. As you can see, I opened the wrong ROM, so I'll open up an unedited ROM to show you how to do this. Click on, click on Open from Header, then click on a number. I'll click on 0 and edit Little Root down. On the right, you'll find a bunch of tiles you can edit with. I'll use concrete, so I click on it and start clicking on the map to lay that tile down. As you can see, I made a mistake, but you can easily fix that. Just like this. Now I've finished laying down concrete and even some fencing, but that doesn't mean I'm done. Because the tree is still left behind mit walking restrictions. So click on movement permissions and you'll see some numbers and letters. Red 1 is for restricted walking, walking space, like a wall. And purple C is for walking space. Let's add some ones where we put fencing and C's where we took out trees. Now you can put in grass where wild Pokemon will appear. Just lay down grass tiles. Then go to wild Pokemon tab.
Click Add Pokemon Data, then check off Grass since that's the kind of encounter type we're adding. You'll then see a list of Pokemon 1 through 12. You can edit the minimum, max, sauce, max, maximum level, type of Pokemon, and encounter ratio. I'll make it a routes level 1 to 5 with an encounter rate of 58%. When you're done, press save, the button next to type, not at the top. Finally, go to events and you can edit sprites, movements, and locations. I'll change the moving truck to a different sprite. Then click save in the upper left and open up your ROM. That's it for my tutorial on advanced map. Go out there and hack.